All right, guys, welcome back. Backstage match now between Randy Orton and uh, Cody Rhodes because I was beating up Cody Rhodes' son. And apparently you don't want to do that because that's not good. It's just like what uh, Cody Rhodes did to uh, Dusty Rhodes and Cody Rhodes did to backstab Rey Mysterio. Uh, Dusty Rhodes took Rey Mysterio's side and then he ended up double-crossing him and helping Cody Rhodes with the victory, which was kind of crappy. I remember that this year. That was this year um, before WrestleMania, if you guys don't remember. I don't like this backstage. There's really nothing I can do. Oh, shit. A whole bucket of stuff. What are we going to use? Oh, garbage can. Right there. Oh, hit him with a belt. How about a fucking piece of wood? You got wood, bro? I want the microphone. Come here. I got something to say to you. Come here. What the hell? That's it? Hit him with that fucking microphone, Randy. Ugh. It's like I'm playing tennis. Ugh. Ugh. That's exactly what it sounds like. RKO! There we go. That's how we win. Now, what do I have to do? Do I... I don't pin him, apparently. I, you would think an RKO would have devastated him by now. And it would have been over. But apparently nothing is working. Hold on. Oh! Oh! Let's put him in Hell's Gate. Hell's Gate, come here. We're gonna put him in the Hell's Gate. Look at this! This one has gotta be over. He's gonna tap out. That shit's over! Randy Orton wins by way of knockout, even though I didn't even think it was a match. Way to go, Randall Keith Orton. You're the fucking man. God, don't even do anything, why don't you? That is one against the for the roads. Yeah, but won't, won't Bob join them? It doesn't even make sense. Oh shit, this feud's going on at no way out. It's about to get real. Way to go, Randy. Who are you celebrating to? Nobody's looking at you. Alright, let's move on. It's time for No Way Out. It's pay-per-view time. There we are. And, uh, for those WWE fans, like, what the hell's No Way Out? No Way Out is the... What Elimination Chamber is now. It's where the Elimination Chamber started. It was that No Way Out. You can probably tell because there was no way out of the cage. Oh, shit. Hopefully, Randy Orton. I don't want to lose it to Cody Rhodes. I don't know if I'm supposed to or not, but it'd be a big bummer city town if I had to lose. All right. Oh, his phone's ringing. What do we got going on? Randy, you mess with the bull, you get the horns. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh shit. Oh my god. I, am I supposed to get screwed over or do I win? The fact that I don't remember is kind of bugging me. I should show him an RKO. Is it a mandatory goal or is it an optional goal to unlock somebody? Oh shit. Cody Rhodes with Dusty Rhodes. Bam. You know what I can do? I can uh, do the taunt. That's how we get it. I get the taunt. And then... There it goes! I gave Dusty Rhodes an RKO. That's exactly what I needed to do. And Cody Rhodes has apparently got a... A finisher. Let's go for it. One! It doesn't even get a one count. Why does he have a repeating finisher that's not going away? Is he supposed to win? It's rigged. Oh, b zigzag. I don't. I hate. I hate the rigged matches. You know. I wish they would let you kind of def define your storyline. I wish that's what they let you do instead of like picking the storyline for you. I wish they would like give you two or three options, and that's what you could choose from. Like, say that week that I was facing Matt and I wanted to win by disqualification. Like they could build it into the storyline. Like I wish it. W I wish it wasn't so linear. You know, I mean, I guess it's because the WWE doesn't want to do programming, and they're so con they're so concerned with other stuff. 
it makes sense, so I'm not going to, like, blame them or anything. But I think that's what they should do. I think that would be awesome to, you know, have a, a unique storyline. I know a few a few um, Road to WrestleManias have that where you can kind of choose a storyline. Like, if I would have just walked away from Dusty Rhodes, I don't know what would have happened because I didn't choose that one. So, for all I know, it could have ended up good for me. Everything could have been fine. Maybe Cody Rhodes would have been on my side when it comes to this match. I don't know. Oh, shit. Hell's Gates. Cody Rhodes is in the Hell's Gates. Is he going to tap? This, this move is fucking vicious. Oh, he taps. I win at No Way Out. Randy fucking Orton is the goddamn champion. That was kind of a boring match. Well, it's not my universe mode, so I'm not going to complain. World Heavyweight Champion Randy motherfucking Orton. Look at that. Oh, see you Monday. It was alright. It wasn't the greatest one. I mean, I mean the match itself was very short. But I, I got my goals, I think, because I RKO'd um, Dusty Rhodes. And I beat Cody Rhodes, which is great. So now, I don't know if I, was, if I could have lost the title there. I don't remember... If it would have made me restart, fuck, I'm out of water. Uh, success. RKO Dusty Rhodes. What do I unlock? It didn't tell me. It just said success. Well, that's no fun. Oh, shit. Here we go. We're in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And uh, we're all excited because we beat him at No Way Out last night. Dusty Rhodes is sitting there cheering him on like a bitch. Yeah, he did, but he lost. No, because Randy Orton beat the shit out of him. And then it's like they, they're going to make a big deal out of the fact that I RKO'd I never RKO'd him. What the hell? I hell's gated him. That doesn't make any sense. Last night at No Way Out, you witnessed the lone legend getting stronger. Yeah, it gave him his money worth. It didn't have the goods. And I'm at this level. Yes, he is. Cody Rhodes, I don't think, is ever going to be as good as his dad was. Or as popular. It's unstoppable. Oh, shit. Yeah, the million dollar man. You look like a million dollars. You really do. Oh, shit. Money, money, money. The million dollar mad Ted DiBiase. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you were in your prime. Yes. You were on top of the world. Multi-time world champion. Uh-oh. No, he didn't. He just called him out. Ever. Yeah. Oh, shit. I wish I was in diapers. Whole attitude. But you didn't. You didn't grow up at all. You'll never listen. Ever. Everybody's got a price. Everybody's got to be. <laughs> there we go. What the hell does this mean? What does it mean for Randy Orton? What does it mean for everybody else, guys? My name is Tubby Emo. I'll see you back in the next part. Peace.